April the 1st, 2016 saw the legal beginning of the new Dorset and Wiltshire Fire and Rescue Service. The newly combined service has 50 fire stations, 73 fire engines and over a thousand full-time and on-call firefighters. It covers a population of over 1.45 million residents in the local authority areas of Bournemouth, Dorset, Poole, Swindon and Wiltshire. Councillor Rebecca Knox has been elected as the first chairman of the new Dorset and Wiltshire Fire and Rescue Authority. Councillor Knox, who represents Beminster on Dorset County Council, was formerly the chairman of Dorset Fire Authority. Very proud indeed to be the, the first chairman of the new authority. Uh, but, but to have that faith from the, the other members of the, the Dorset and Wiltshire Fire Authority and to be able to give the commitment that I know I'm going to give, um, I'm really looking forward to it. It's the next step in the, in the journey. Her vice chairman is Councillor Gary Perkins, formerly vice chairman of Wiltshire and Swindon Combined Fire Authority, who represents the Hayden Wick Ward on Swindon Borough Council. Chief Fire Officer Darren Gunter and his senior leadership team are based at the new service headquarters in Salisbury, which forms part of the Five Rivers Health and Wellbeing Centre, owned by Wiltshire Council. Today we begin a new race, we begin a new journey as one complete new fire and rescue services, committed to our communities and passionate about changing and saving lives. The inauguration of the new service was attended by fire authority members, partners and local dignitaries from across the two counties. The former headquarters buildings in Pottern in Wiltshire and Poundbury in Dorset are now being used as area offices, with a full review of the services estate being undertaken. A joint services control centre at Pottern was opened in August 2015 and has been dealing with 999 calls for both counties since that time.